So Stalker 2 Heart of Chernobyl's pre-orders have opened up and they are extensive. We actually have seven different options to choose from and if you're a hardcore Stalker fan or a collector, you're going to love some of these options. Hey guys, this is Chris with BNB Gaming. Welcome back and I hope you're doing amazing today. If this is your first time here and you're interested in Stalker 2 and other hardcore games like the Callisto Protocol, Evil West, hit that subscribe button for more content. Now to start out with guys, unfortunately Stalker 2 Heart of Chernobyl has been delayed until 2023. However, this hasn't stopped GSC Game World from opening up pre-orders for Stalker 2. And again, if you're a hardcore Stalker fan or a collector, some of these you're going to want to jump on I think right away because from my experience, normally collector's editions disappear pretty quickly and end up on eBay for like $1,000 or something. <laughs> well anyways, let's start with the physical options for Stalker 2. To start with, they're offering a pre-order bonus, which first includes extended campfire content. Its description says, This content includes additional songs and stories that players can hear from the NPCs around the campfires. The bonus also includes an early bird weapon skin, early bird costume skin, and an early bird multiplayer badge. As far as the different editions, to start with we have the standard physical edition of Stalker 2 Heart of Chernobyl. As far as the features of Stalker 2 it says, it has a new story that follows the events of the original games, multiple factions and NPCs, a large and dynamic open world set in the zone, numerous weapons, armors and artifacts, survival gameplay mechanics, and finally mutants, enemy stalkers, and other threats. So the standard physical edition of Stalker 2 is going to come in a rounded steel bookcase and also features Stalker 2 cover art. It's also going to include a letter from the developers, a souvenir zone permit, along with a sticker pack which includes stickers of mutants, NPCs, weapons, and more. Now the standard edition, at least here in the United States, retails for $60. The next physical edition is the limited edition and this is for $80. Now the limited edition basically features everything the standard edition has and adds a zone map. Its description says, detailed map of Stalker 2's Chernobyl exclusion zone. It also adds a Stalker 2 poster. The limited edition also features faction patches, so patches for the loner, duty, freedom, and monolith factions. It's also going to feature a stalker themed military dog tag token. And finally, the limited edition also is going to have a stalker themed keychain with fire starter. The next physical edition they're offering is the collector's edition. So, with the collector's edition, which is $180, you're going to get all the stuff that you get with the limited edition, along with an additional story based side quest one new costume and three weapon skins for your single player character, two new costumes and three weapon skins for your multiplayer character. And you're probably thinking, wait a second, Stalker 2 is going to have multiplayer? According to the developers, Stalker 2 is going to be getting multiplayer as a free update after launch. Along with that, in the collector's edition, you're going to get a digital art book and the digital soundtrack for Stalker 2. And probably what I would get the collector's edition for, you get the Stalker figurine. Its description says a statue of a mass Stalker holding a moonlight artifact. It doesn't give any description, the size or anything of the figurine, but I think it looks pretty cool. Finally, for the Ultimate Stalker fan and collector, we have the Stalker 2 Ultimate Edition for $350. Now, currently it's not available for pre-order yet, but I'm guessing in the next couple weeks, all of a sudden, boom, it's going to be available. And just like most of these really nice collector's edition, you know, bundles for other games, I'm expecting this is going to be really limited, so if you see this pop up as being available, I probably would pre-order it just so you get yours if you really want it. Now with the Ultimate Edition, you get all the content you get with the Collector's Edition, plus you get the Stalker 2 Season Pass, which will include two story expansions and all future DLC. Along with that, you also get seven costumes for multiplayer versus the two costumes you get with the Collector's Edition. 
Along with that you also get an art book featuring Stalker 2 concept artwork. You of course get the Stalker 2 figurine and probably what I would get this for, you get a Stalker themed backpack and you also get the artifact container lamp. Its description says, designed to look like a container with a fireball artifact inside. As far as the digital options go, again they're offering a pre-order bonus, which will include the extended campfire content, early bird weapon skin, early bird costume skin, and of course the early bird multiplayer badge. Now Stalker 2 is going to be available on PC through the Epic Games Store and Steam and Xbox.com or Microsoft Store. And I point this out because Steam is offering exclusive content in the form of what they say is a dynamic profile theme, an animated profile avatar, and avatar frame. Now as far as the digital options, first we have the standard edition, which is basically just the game. You don't get any digital content, etc. It's just Stalker 2. The next edition they offer is the Deluxe Edition for $80. With the Deluxe Edition, of course you get Stalker 2. You also get an additional story-based side quest, one costume and three weapon skins for single player, and two costumes and three weapon skins for multiplayer. In addition, you also get the digital art book and digital soundtrack. Finally, for $110, you can get the Ultimate Edition of Stalker 2. Now the Ultimate Edition has everything the Deluxe Edition has, plus it includes the Season Pass, which has two story expansions and all future DLC. And you also get seven multiplayer costumes versus two costumes with the Deluxe Edition. So basically the Ultimate Edition of Stalker 2 has all the digital content that the Ultimate Edition of the Physical Edition of Stalker 2 has, so the Season Pass, etc. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Are you still hyped up for Stalker 2? Are you excited to finally get to play this, hopefully next year? Let me know what you think. For me, currently, I have Game Pass, so I have the option to play the Standard Edition of Stalker 2. Now that said, I'm seriously thinking about getting the Digital Ultimate Edition, so I get the Season Pass, and the other digital goodies.